A bluegrass tradition is heading to northwest Wisconsin once again. The Cameron Bluegrass Festival will be held at the Pioneer Village Museum next weekend, September 6th through the 8th. And here now with more are Kathy Krug and Chris Landstrom. Thanks for being with us. Thanks, Thanks for, for having, having us. us. So Kathy, give us a little background of this festival. Well, this is the 18th year and um, it, I'm a hairdresser in Cameron and I had a client come in and tell me that uh, her new job was museum manager and could I think of anything that could bring people into the museum and I said boy that'd be a perfect place for a bluegrass festival <laughs> yeah so that's that's, that's how it started, that's how it started. <laughs> and a, be a beautiful spot if, if it no is. one has ever been up there to that that it's it really is. one of those hidden gems in northwest Wisconsin it's, it's a beautiful museum and it's it's a pioneer village so it's got all the buildings that are open mm -hmm. um, for the cost that it costs to get into the festival you can go through all of okay, all the buildings so that's open and everything as mm -hmm. well. Yeah. And Chris, um, you've got headliners. You've got lots of music. Tell us about that. Yeah, our good buddy Tommy Brown is coming back again. He was one of the first big headliners we ever had several years ago, and uh, he retired on us. And we've talked him into coming out of retirement and coming back for our festival. Mm -hmm. And if you've not seen Tommy Brown play, you need to come to this festival. Plays banjo. It looks He's like. He's a banjo player. Yep. He's uh, just a little bit under five feet tall, but he plays like he's 10 feet tall. He's <laughs> oh, an amazing wow. man. He's fantastic. And then we also have Art Stevenson and Highwater, who's a very popular Wisconsin band from over in the Wausau area. And uh, they were here last year. Again, phenomenal band. Mm -hmm. Really fun to, to hear. Right. And, and then uh, mm -hmm. both those folks, Tommy Brown and Art Stevenson and his band are going to put some workshops on for us, okay. too. Okay. That's great. So yeah, people, musicians, anybody yep. who wants yep. to learn anybody more can about take that? the workshops. Yeah. Yep. and they're free. Right, right. and the string smiths, which yep. you are a part of, they're yep. also going to perform. We'll be there too. Yep, they're letting us come back again. <laughs> well, that's good. <laughs> yeah, and there's there's a picture of, of your band as well. Yeah. Cost to attend that that type of thing? What's that? Cost? Yes. So um, Friday it's fifteen dollars. Saturday it's twenty five, and Sunday is fifteen or fifty dollars for a weekend pass. Okay. And that's really reasonable. Um, other festivals, I just was to one last weekend. I was ninety dollars to get in, get wow. in the door. So, so it's pretty cheap, and uh, we're just real excited about the eighteenth year. We got yeah. great people, musicians are great. Um, on Saturday at five o'clock, um, the who's the band? Um, New Midnight Coal Company is playing. Yep. Okay. And we stop uh, and have a Quilt of Valor presentation. Oh, okay. For a local veteran. Oh, all right. And that's and 5 o'clock on Saturday. 5 o'clock on Saturday, okay. yep. And we do have more information on our website as well. Again, September 6th through the 8th at the Pioneer Village Museum in Cameron. Thanks again for being with us. Appreciate Thanks it. Thanks so Thank much. For, yeah. And we'll be right back.